We are uh, in southern Oregon, uh, in Rogue River, Oregon. And uh, which are the rules in Oregon to grow a plantation of cannabis? Uh, currently the recreational rules, uh, the maximum canopy space you can have uh, for our license is 40,000 square feet, so just under one acre. Okay, and this is this plantation is? This is just under, yeah, it's uh, 39,580 square feet. Okay, and uh, so you have uh, to buy a license or something like that? What's yeah. We, uh, we buy it from the state of Oregon once okay. a year um, and it's good for the next year. Yeah. Okay. And uh, which kind of uh, variety are you growing here? Uh, it's all OG Kush. So uh, it's all different hybrids of, of Indica and Sativa, uh, different crosses and different, you know, different strains. Uh, but all of them are crossed with OG Kush. Okay, so are you crossing and creating also new genetics, new... Yeah, everything here is all, is all new. And uh, can you tell us uh, something about the techniques you use to grow uh, the if are organic plants, something like that? Yeah, you know, we use a pretty basic method. Um, the soil that we use is, is basically inert, uh, you know, forest bottom. So it's basically like decomposing... Uh, pieces of, of wood and stuff from the forest bottom and then we add uh, you know just organic nutrients through through the the, the liquid and nutrients we feed uh, every day and that's pretty much it everything is organic um, all the nutrients are organic they're different fertilizers basically from animals animal based fertilizers um, birds and bats and you know the different kinds of fish and uh, cows and everything everything is organic and from organic matter okay uh, last question according to you in general the legalization in oregon how is going on uh, which are the positive sides and uh, if there are some uh, negative sides uh, you know honestly i don't i don't see the negative sides haven't really come out yet because it's still developing but the positives really the way that the way the system works in oregon uh is a lot more user friendly than say Washington or Colorado so far uh, it's a lot more friendly to the grower and to the you know ultimately to the consumer at the end result because they're gonna have a lot better product at a way more reasonable rate at their final retail sale than either Washington or Colorado has ever been able to afford especially right when the retail market opens I'd just like to uh, direct everyone to our website, southernoregoncannabiscompany.com. Uh, we have all our different strains on there and uh, the, the test results, when they come out, they will be updated. So you'll have all the different strains, our whole list of strains, edibles, our whole entire product line, pictures of our gardens, pictures of the people here working, how we do uh, uh, lists of all the edible, of all the, uh, the products that we put into our grow products and all that. Uh, and all that information will be available through our website, southernoregoncannabiscompany.com.